Hey guys, welcome back to Tomb Raider 2013 with the Long Couch. We are deep in enemy territory, and I think we have to fight our way out of this village here. Could end up being tricky. Shoot arrows into walls near enemies to distract them. Looks like a smaller group escaped into the lower forest. Maybe we get a hunting party down there. No, Father Matthias went to sell. What was that? What was that indeed? Okay, I didn't think he died from that first shot. <laughs> I was like, oh my god! But he totally did. Yeah, I got a heads up on those first couple videos, guys, that uh, when it comes to headshots with arrows, you don't actually have to charge them the entire way. Which, honest to god, feels really, really, really wrong. But it is really helpful to know. If I can get used to doing that, then, you know, you can save yourself some time, some heartache. Might end up being a little easier in the long run, so... Yeah. Those, uh... Those first two videos were pretty rough from a production standpoint. I'm hoping this goes a little better. Please, please, please. Please don't crash. <laughs> I hate when stuff like that interrupts the the flow of the video. The atmosphere, you know? But, so far so good. Hopefully I didn't jinx myself. Glass lanterns. Shoot glass lanterns to break them and create fire. Killer! Pyromaniac challenge unlocked. We gotta shoot those every time we find them. Alright, these dudes want me dead so bad. Ooh. Hey, we've unlocked stealth kill. Stealth kill enemies by pressing Y when close. I would love to stealth kill this guy. They didn't say anything about having to mash X. I don't know how they can't see me right there. Their flashlights are like right on me. But I'm okay with that. I'm always happy when a game is somewhat lenient on the whole stealth aspect. What? Oh, shit. Ooh, reloading. Ah! Set my ass on fire. How do I do a melee attack? I don't think I can do straight up melee attacks right now. That sucks. Could you do me a favor and stop setting me on fire, please? Ha! Did you drop it? What? He's still coming. Oh fuck! I thought he was dead from that. This dude's taking like eleven bullets. All right, somebody else still knows where I am. Oh my god, everything's on fire. Bullets. We're not going that way. Okay. Model unlocked. Okay, I guess we're good. I thought there were still dudes who knew where I was because, like, somebody was still throwing fire at me when I was up in that last sequence, but whatevs. When we washed up on this rock, the rain and wind pounded us for days. I pounded your mom for we days. We couldn't build shelter or forage for food. Christ, we couldn't even move. It was like some enormous hand was holding us down. Just as the storm was finally breaking, Father Matthias came to us. He was calm and soft-spoken. He seemed to know us, our names, where we were from. He spoke to us in our native language, and we listened. And as we listened, he told us the truth of this island. He offered us a choice, salvation or death. Some chose to defy him. 
And without hesitation, he killed them then and there. Father Matthias didn't seem malicious or angry, just calm and decisive. As I stood there in the sand, wet with the blood of my comrades, I knew I could never refuse him. Okay, so basically he's a cult leader. <laughs> Good to know. Father Matthias, bad dude. Don't cross him. Kill him the first chance we get. I'm sure it'll be that simple. Okay, let's see if I can burn this guy down. Fire is needed to ignite this object. And I don't have a torch to light right now. Maybe I can find one. Da, 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 da. Up here, maybe? Ooh, there's some stuff in there. Oh. Okay, that destroyed the lantern, but it doesn't allow me to pick up the fire and use it. A silk fan. Could have been used by a villager or a noble, maybe. Cool. One of two Edo period fans found. I guess there's nothing extra on this. I gotta say, guys, I really like the level design in this game. It did a really good job of, like, keeping it feeling natural, I guess. Like, it's integrated very well into the design of the whole environment. I guess is what I'm trying to say. There be three. Ah, uh, I think I can light my torch down on this guy down here. There we go. Can I keep it lit as I climb this, though? Totally. Excellent. This should be salvage. Which is stuff that I want. Perfect. Okay, let's see what new horrors await us up here. Probably 8,000 more guys trying to kill us. As soon as I get the ability to stealth kill people without having to jam on X, that's gonna be my first priority, guys. I can do this. This is extremely dangerous without gear. This rock is soaking wet. I'm going to slip on everything. I am now officially high enough to die straight up from a fall. But we're good. Whoa. Who the hell was just shooting at what? Ah! Roth, I'm coming! Ooh, he got messed up. Our god's got nothing to do with it. It's good to see you two go. Sorry, they did a real number on your leg. Oh, no. Looks worse than it is. Uh, Have you heard from any of the others? Nothing. Wait, what are you doing? The wolves took my food pack. The transmitter from the lifeboat's in it. If we don't get that back, we're not getting off this bloody island. Yeah, you need you need bandages, morphine, antiseptic. We're also in the pack. Shit. So, <laughs> come here. She looks so obstinate about that. Like, oh, that stupid pack. No, 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 no. Oh, don't do this to me, you northern bastard. <laughs> okay. 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 Thank God he's 
alive. Somewhere. And that wolf's like straight up waiting for me. Okie dokie. Well, first things first, I'm gonna skin this guy. Because he doesn't need a skin anymore. We saw to that. I don't think I can quite get over there just yet. I don't know, this is a big area. There's a lot to do here, I think. Oh, I think we gotta burn those flags too, which I don't think I can do until I get fire arrows. Unless I can... find a way to make a makeshift fire arrow. Is that how it works in this game? No. This isn't Zelda. <laughs> but I will go ahead and grab this. Maybe I can use it... Well, first of all, I think I can use it on this right here. Nice. Chicken! I'm gonna kill you in a second, chicken. I think as soon as I aim... Oh! I'm on... Right, I can't use my bow and the torch at the same time, but I can use my pistol. That's okay. He's hiding in the brush. That's a smart chicken. Oh, I got him. <laughs> I didn't think I actually hit him with that. Cool, though. Uh, let's see. What else do I need fire for, guys? Maybe that? I don't know. I vaguely recall getting an ability later that lets me interact with stuff like that, but I don't really remember how it all worked. I don't think I can shoot this down, either. Yeah, it's protected. It's not part of the collectibles. The collectathon that is this game. I need XP. Come back. Damn it. It's actually really hard to shoot these little critters with a bow. They're so skittish. I guess I should see if Laura has anything to say. Also, I have a skill point I can spend, so. No, nothing to say. All right, look for that later, I suppose. So, survivor upgrades. Do I want any of these right now? I want something that will let me do a stealth kill. Hunter upgrades. Ah, uh, this is increases the ammo capacity, steady shots. Hmm. Most of these are still locked, which sucks. Hmm. This is probably a good one. Now I can take more time to charge up my bow shots when I need to. And also, do I have enough for that other bow upgrade? Let's see. No, that's 250. I don't have quite enough for that. How about the pistol? 450, 200. Port vented slide required. Yeah. Those are expensive. I need much more salvage. Many salvage. Such wow. Okay. Let's see where we can get in this area, guys. Can I climb this already? Nope, I need an upgrade for that, I think. They're kind of, uh... They're kind of stonewalling me right now. Literally. <laughs> I got the damn chicken. Give me that. Ha! Nope. I think I can climb this. Yeah! Ooh! I was gonna try and shoot down this lantern up here, but I think all the ones in this area are ones that I can't actually shoot down. These ruins. 
Kamakura period. Was all this part of Yamatai? Could be. After a fortnight, I was at last granted an audience with Her Majesty, Himiko of Yamatai. I must confess, she is unlike any woman I have ever encountered. Beautiful, yet inscrutable, calculating even. She surrounds herself with her priestesses of the sun. No men attend her, save the general of her armies. When I met with her alone, I came to realize that she is not at all what she seems. I was sent by my lord to spy on her, to assess the strength of her armies. But now, I feel she is the one assessing me. My lord has perhaps underestimated the threat of Yamatai. Though I cannot gauge the true strength of her storm god, I cannot deny a powerful feeling that the Sun Queen should not be trifled with. Yes, pretty much everything we've discovered has indicated that. Himiko was a badass. Much respect. You know guys, Queen Himiko is also a character in one of my favorite games, Okami. Which I'm going to play on my channel someday. But, it's uh... It's interesting to think about, like, how steep she is in, uh, you know, Eastern mythology. And every time I hear her name, it makes me want to play that game. <laughs> uh, I gotta get some fire up here. Missing out on things. Where should I even be going from here? Hey, shut up! You're noisy. I'm trying to concentrate on stuff down here. Let's see, I can't climb up the ropes. Which means we must find another way. Can't quite get down there. Like, everything is blocked off right now, guys. We're being gated by abilities. Can I get up here? Here we go. Okay, here I can grab some fire. Don't know if I'll need it, but I'll bring it along. Shit. Damn. Is that lightning? This is a very dangerous place. Good thing I have a wooden bow and not a metal one. Yeah, I can't climb this surface yet. That bothers me, because I know I'll be able to at one point. <laughs> but for now, all I can do is bypass it. Oh. Okay. Wolves are very close by. What the hell is that noise? Oh, that's probably like a transponder from the pack. Let's look over here first. What is this shit? What is all this? We've got cave paintings. Just hanging out up here. Well, all right. Into the darkness I go. This is actually really creepy. I just want the pack. That's all. It's that stupid alarm. Ah, fuck you. Sure. Sure we won't have any problems here at all. Okay, I'm running for it. Ah! It's 
right, bitch. <laughs> no kidding. I just went Ted Bundy on that motherfucker. Woo! Although I'm kind of glad that was the only one. <laughs> Alright. I'm leaving. Yes, we gotta get back down there. I'm aware. So theoretically with this, we should be able to patch up Roth. Keep him in good shape. He seems like he knows what he's doing. We're going to need him, I think. I just got to get back down here without killing myself. This ought to work. Ooh. Yep, we're good. <laughs> Surprised there aren't more wolves down here. Ah, oh, I love chicken. Om nom nom. The hell's all the way up there? You have to ring that bell. Right. Let's get you patched up. Like you learn to do a thing like that. <laughs> Late shift at the nine bells. <laughs> Wolf's got nothing on a broken bottle. <laughs> hey, you got it. Nice work. So I assume the plan is to take that up to the radio tower. Well, that should give us the best shot of broadcasting a strong signal in every direction. Type of my fast learner then. Just be careful, Laura. That's nice. I didn't know we were going to get that thing this early. New gear acquired you climbing axe. To go on the rock wall over there first. Indeed. Actually, what I really want to do is check and see if there's an upgrade for it that I can get already. Thank God for us training. All those treks, all those climbs. It's as if he'd been preparing me for something like this all along. It's clear that there are people living here, and they're organized. They're killing and recruiting. But why? It's like some kind of cult. But a cult of what? What do they want? What are they looking for? Those are good questions. You know what else is a good question? Is how the upgrade that I applied to the old climbing axe somehow applies to the new one already. Not complaining, just saying it's really weird. Alright, this is good though. This is what I wanted. I can climb this. Oh, uh, yeah, I always love the way the climbing felt in this game. 
It's kind of like Uncharted, except it feels more like a puzzle because you're more in direct control of where you're going. And when you stick the axe in to climb things, it just feels really good. It feels nice, and I like it. And now we can just completely bypass all that crap we had to do before, pretty much. Oh! Until you fuck up like that. <laughs> you miss one stick, and you fall to your doom. But I survived. You gotta be careful when you're jumping sideways like that. Do it! Okay. He's trying to give me a tutorial. I know how it works. It's just... Being a pain about it. I guess I should... Gingerly get myself over to the edge and then jump. Instead of trying to be fast about it. Secret tomb nearby. Oh. Oh, is that what this stuff indicates? Right. Right. I think that is the case. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, let's get in here and do a secret tomb, guys. If I remember correctly, there aren't quite as many in this game as there were in the sequel. But there's still some. Gonna want that, apparently. Because I didn't have a choice in the matter. <laughs> Oh, another friendly area. Cool. Hey, look. Stalagmites. They come from the floor. Stalactites come from the ceiling. Damn, how many people just got tied up and left to die in here? What happened? This was like somebody's slave cave. Tomb of the Unworthy, New Camp Discovered. Very good. I'm not going to be able to take this anyway. <laughs> okay. Gilded figures, servants of the Sun Queen. Hmm. Giant gilded figures. You know, if we were able to break off even, like, one pound of that gilded figure, we'd be rich for the rest of our lives. Sacrifice. Murder. There's no record of these kinds of rituals in ancient Yamatai. Unless it was erased from the texts. Hmm. Okay. Need fire to set that on fire. Where do I get the fire from? So if I push this off the edge... Well, that actually just made it go lower. <laughs> push this off the edge. That raises that guy up. If I can get up on top real quick... I can't get up fast enough. That's my problem right now. Why can't I use any of these candles to light my torch on fire? That would be ideal. Okay, well I guess for now I can jump over to this side. Ooh. Here we go. Now I burn all these away. Without the extra weight, it should bring me back up. Yay. So. I still, I still can't quite reach up there, though. I wonder if this thing will go even higher if I push it off now. Will it allow me to climb up? There it is. That's what we needed. Get a 
do this part carefully. There we go. Hey, we got a skill point for that. Is that really all there was? In honor of her priestesses. Incredible. Short tomb. <laughs> Oh, I got a weapon mod. Nice. Okay. So I guess that's where we get the weapon mods from. Yeah, I didn't remember that. That is dope. I don't think they told me which weapon it was for, though. If they did, I completely missed it. Well, let's check. Oh, and I got a crazy amount of salvage for that, too. Wow. So... We need two more parts to upgrade this. And three more parts to upgrade the pistol. So I don't even know what part that was for, but whatever. We're going to go ahead and upgrade the bow straight away. Reinforce limbs. And that brings us back down to 172. I don't think I can do anything else. Yeah. Soon we'll be able to upgrade the pistol. If we even want to. And then let's see about spending this point... Advanced salvaging? Yes. Increase the amount of salvage we get. It's the gift that keeps on giving. Alright. That's one optional tomb out of the way, guys. I can't remember how many there are. I don't think there's a ton. But we'll do them as we find them, obviously, of course. They're part of the game. They're fun. Oh, I got a map update, too. Let's see. So there's a tomb. Is that showing... Oh, that's one I haven't done yet, huh? I didn't realize it was this close. Probably can't reach it yet, though. I think a lot of them are gated off by abilities that you don't get until later. But this one's out of the way. Okay, they want me to go up there. 